Hi friends, this is Dr. Shardi Shreemoyi. Welcome back. The festival of colors, Holi is around. I love to play Holi and I'm sure you guys love it too. But most of us are scared to play Holi because of the harmful effects the color, the water and everything has on our hair, skin and our nails. Well, I'll not let these worries dampen your spirits of festivities this time. So here I have come with this video with a few tips and tricks that will help you protect your skin before and after playing Holi. Not only your skin, your skin, hair and your nails before and after playing Holi. Let's go ahead with it. Hello everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Dr. Shardi Srimoy, founder of Riju Aesthetic Clinic. I'm an MBBS doctor by qualification and an aesthetic physician by profession. One of the most crucial things is to prep the skin against the harsh effects of color and water that we play. You may choose to play with organic colors, but we cannot take guarantee of the people playing around with you. So the idea is to minimize the damage to the skin. One of the most important steps is to hydrate the skin before stepping out of the house. How you hydrate the skin is to apply a thick layer of moisturizer all over your body and your face before stepping out of the house. What it does is that it creates a barrier between the skin and the colors of holy so that it does not penetrate deeper into the skin and helps removing it easier. So the moisturizers that I usually prefer are those containing shea butter, cocoa butter because they are thick and they have a they help in maintaining a thicker layer. Uh, another uh, tip that I would like to give here is that you can use coconut oil also as a barrier moisturizer that also helps in creating a very good barrier and also protects the skin from the harmful effects of the chemicals and the paints that are being used during Holi. Make sure you apply the moisturizer on your entire body and not just your face so that because you never know where the colors are going to go anywhere in your body. Number two, apply a good sunscreen on your face and all over your body. A sunscreen again acts as a barrier and it protects the skin from the heat and the damages of the sun. So how to apply a sunscreen? Apply it at least 15 to 20 minutes before you leave the house on top of the moisturizer. Apply two finger units and always, always, I repeat, remember to apply it all over your body and not just your face. Number three, holy not only uh, stains your skin and your hair, but it also leaves very ghastly looking pigmentation on your nails because it enters the nail bed it enters the cuticles and then on the next day it looks very unappeasing so what you can do is that firstly you can trim your nail uh, trim your nail so that you know it doesn't get the colors don't get inside the nails then you can apply a layer of oil before going out to play ideally olive oil is very good because olive oil again is very good for your nail health on top of that you can apply a uh, transparent coat of nail paint that which again you can remove after you play holy that again helps in preventing the stain and colors getting inside your cuticles and nail bed number four wear full sleeve clothes both on the upper and the lower body that will help prevent penetration or reduce the penetration of colors directly into the skin although clothes are not going to completely you know prevent penetration of colors but for that we have already taken the previous uh, precautions that were supposed to be taken number five stay hydrated although you you might be playing with pichkaris you know uh, water balloons uh, rain dancing swimming pools you know all those things but still you are remember that you are outdoors and right play playing right under the sun for hours so dehydration is going to happen so it is always advised to carry a bottle of water with you if you can carry detox water with you that will help you hydrate it or not leave you dr feeling drained by the end of the day number six for your hair for your hair the best option is the age-old chumpy it will help again create a barrier between your hair your scalp and the colors so do a proper chumpy if possible apply a bandana or a cap on your head to prevent further penetration minimize the contact of colors so that when you wash off it doesn't end up being dry your hair doesn't end up being dry and lifeless number seven it's very important to protect your lips as well because like i said you're out there uh, in the outdoors under the sun playing for so many hours so it's very uh, common that your lips might get chapped and dehydrated so apply a moisturizing lip balm with a good spf 
Number eight, do not do any salon or clinic treatments like medifacials, laser, peels, 48 to 72 hours before playing holy because the skin might be sensitive and when you're playing outdoors and exposed to all these chemicals and colors, you never know how your skin is going to react to it. Do your procedures after, a few days after that I'm coming and then coming in this video itself. Number nine, use organic colors. Avoid the ones which contain uh, copper sulfate, lead oxide, you know, etc. So that we can protect not only ourselves but our near and dear ones also. Next, let us go to the post holy skin and hair care tips. Firstly, avoid any potent formulations. Your skin has been already exposed to so much, it is going to be sensitive for a few days. So avoid using your regular skincare regime if you have any, uh, like alcohol-based toners, you know, uh, kojic acid, glycolic acid, retinols, all those products, avoid using them for at least the next 48 to 72 hours. Give your uh, skin the rest it needs, the care it needs. Apply just moisturizer and sunscreen and you know, give it the rest that it needs. Number two, avoid any medical grade procedures such as peels, medifacials, lasers, microdermabrasion that may further exfoliate and make the skin sensitive for at least the next 48 to 72 hours. Don't jump directly into the shower. First, apply cold pressed coconut oil all over the body on the colors and let the colors soak in and soften a bit. Then try to remove it with a dry cloth or a slightly damp cloth, try to remove the colors and then after the initial upper layer of the uh, color is gone, then you jump into a gentle shower and try to uh, rub off the uh, colors. Do not go, again do not use very high fragrance based uh, shower gels, very strong ones, use with mild uh, cleanser or soap. Similarly for face, use a gentle oil based cleanser first to clean the face and then go for a face wash, mild face wash. Uh, do not go for scrubbers and you know all those harsh chemicals to clean the face right after playing holy. After washing, apply a lot of calming moisturizer, lot of moisturizer on the skin and sunscreen to calm your face and calm the sensitiveness that has uh, happened because of playing holy. Shampoo your hair and then deep condition it for at least 15 to 20 minutes for your hair cuticles to recover from the damage of the colors and then wash it off. Lastly, again, keep yourself hydrated with your detox water and your thandais. I wish you a very happy holy.